Last time we got through finally to the beginning or past the credits at least, so that was quite a hefty intro. But well, here we are on hey, episode three. Right, so we're on chapter three. The Malaysian job. Don't know exactly what we're looking for. Here we go. This looks amazing. Oh my god. What's that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We got a treasure. Okay, we found something. Hey, I got something here. What is it? A little rust, white color. Maybe hit the rocks, tore off before it's over. Hey, you're mumbling. <laughs> Sorry. Now, it looks like a piece of our wreck. Must be close by. You're teasing me now, Drake. You're teasing me. I'm kind of getting dragged along a bit. So we have a one of these there. giant cargo rig things, shipping oh. containers. Morning, fellas. All right, I'm in. It looks like a lot of it's still strapped down. So we found the other one. <laughs> found the other crate. One I just down, said that. One to go. Secure it in the trailer. We're nearly at your position. All right. See you soon. Put in there. All right, that's one crate secure. Good timing. We're right above you. Sling's on its way down. Coming down. Okay, it's in position. Look up the trailer. We'll raise it up a bit for you.
Ah. All right, you watch your oxygen now. I like yeah, that. Funny. Okay, got the cable. I'm going to try looping it around one of the axes. That should work. Yeah. Up a bit. Up, 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 up. There we go. No, no. Aha. Okay, trailer secure, ready to go. All right. Get clear. We'll lift it up. Ready when you are. And up we go. Okay. Is that enough? Yeah, plenty. Just don't drop it on me. <laughs> no promises. Okay. Got the other crate. I'm gonna strap it in with the others. And we are in. Probably a good and accounted for. Huh, with five minutes of oxygen to spare. Jesus. Hey, maybe you should hang out then. See if you can find some other treasures down there. <laughs> nah, I'm good. Wanna ride up? <laughs> Love one. Let me know when you're on the sling. Get me out of here, will you? You got it. Going up. This would be great to see in VR, wouldn't it? Uh -huh. Look at that beauty. How you feeling? Oh, better now that I'm out of that river. I'm gonna stick like fish for a week. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna come to you. Hang on. Hang on. So where are we? Are we in Scotland? job easier, right? Drake, gotta say that wasn't the slowest dive I've ever sat through. <laughs> Hold on, is that a compliment? I'm stunned. Nah, you know what's stunning? Your smell. <laughs> <Woo>! <laughs> I don't know, man. I kind of like it. Reminds me of your mom. <laughs> That's cold, man. I'm gonna tell her you said that, too. My man. How'd we do? How do you think? Full recovery? Every last bit. <laughs> Making the rest of us look bad. Making the rest of you look good. How we doing down there? Give me a second. I wish they were Give me a second. Give me Shit. 
briefing vessels waiting. Don't you worry. I like it. Their interaction between NPCs. Let's wrap this up later. My hero. <laughs> Come on. Let's go see what you brought us. Hey, so how about you let someone else be point man next time? You've earned a break. No, no thanks. Take a dive over being at the office any day. Yeah, well, uh, either way, it's gonna be a while to the next dive. What are you talking about? What about Thursday's job? Oh, come on, no. Got under bid. You gotta be kidding me. Hey, competition's tough. Let's see here now. Care to do the honors? Yeah, why the hell not? Thanks. Same to you. I think I'm just gonna do the paperwork and uh, get home and crash. Rain check though. All right. Suit so yourself. Hey, good work today. Thanks. Coppers. Thank you, obviously, would bite. Say hi to Carly and the kids for me, all right? No pressure, Nate. But think about it. You really did your homework on this one. Down the search area. Would make a hell of a find. Son of a bitch. <laughs> no, no, no way. You are going with the others. Well, that was a short one. <laughs> some years back. Can we look out the window? Kind of. Look at us. Shadow 
Shambhala. <laughs> Shambhala stones. Miss you, pal. Didn't flip it. Sir Francis and his elaborate puzzles. Yeah, okay. Trip down memory lane. Yeah, okay, we get it. Okay, and the. I suppose it's an interesting way of bringing in the shooting mechanics. Yeah, I'll be right there. See ya. <laughs> Still got it. Well, that's that. I'll clean it up next time. <laughs> Yep. So Hey, honey, I'm home. Is this what you're working on? Searching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just wrapping up here. No, oh, yeah, sure thing. Thanks. Are we gonna cook? It's about spicy dumplings. What are we gonna have? Beer?
Finish it? Yeah. Oh. You know, it's probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? God, I'm starving. Looks good. Mm-hmm. Joe, so, how was your day? What? Huh? Got none of that. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm-hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm-hmm. I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm. Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? No, oh, some brilliant stuff. It was a uh, early 21st century truck. We got, apparently the natives called it a semi. Oh dear lord. So, some, some boring stuff. Tell me about the article. Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is going to like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shocking the lungs at the second you got off the plane. Ah! here and stab with a fork. Oh, really? <laughs> what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? This one? Mm-hmm. Uh, the people of, of uh, Bangkok. And, and the smog, and how they, they can't, uh, can't get a flight anywhere, and people can't breathe. Wow. I'm sorry. No, it was Valiant. Re I was in the really ballpark, right? In a different state, but yeah, you were in a ballpark. <laughs> in a ballpark, not the ballpark. Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again. Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job. Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. You know what? I don't want it. Really. I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't seen him Elena, in about two years. Well, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Just stop. I'll do them. No, you on. did them last night. No, you cooked. I cleaned. It's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me, let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me, uh, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. TV you game thing. Beat my high score on my TV game thing? Yeah, I think you're scared now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's <laughs> called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So, what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? Oh, wow. Okay, cowboy. PS1? Okay. Watch. <laughs> shameless, no, shameless no. advertising oh. PlayStation. Shameless. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to. Okay, there we go. Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? No, no, just uh, do you uh, they make it go. Push the start button. I knew that. All right, I got it. Okay, so you want to run towards the camera. Run to the camera, got it. And the circle button is your spin attack. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. <laughs> Look at that spinning hurt. Watch that pit. Watch 
watching. I watched it. What is that thing? A fox? A bandicoot. Looks like a fox. It's like a fox in jeans. Oh, for God's fox. sake. Why is a fox smashing crates? Bandicoot. And that's just, it's what he does. It's a fox and it's not very realistic. Come on, come on, come on, come on. God, I haven't played <laughs> Crash. No, not really. Sure they don't wear sneakers. Uh, these graphics are pretty good. Aren't they? Use your spin attack. Which button? Circle spin attack. Ow! Oh, oh come on, I jumped that one. Last life. Yeah, that life. Screw you, bitch. Screw you, bitch. You know, games were so basic back then, but they were also not very easy. Jump, jump. Yeah, I am. I'm encouraging, I'm coaching you. Keep going, keep going. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay, grab the fruit. What is the fruit? Can't grab the fruit. A hundred? Who's got time to pick a hundred pieces of fruit? Crash Bandicoot, apparently. Oh! Come on! <laughs> Hi, Sandin. What? Well. That's it? the end of that. <laughs> you asked for it. Oh, but you gotta be kidding me! I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on. Nah, no, you're right. <laughs> I've had my fit of Crash Bandicoot. There's this mode called Easy Mode. I just switch it. It's way easier on. No, just keep talking. Keep talking. What are you gonna do? I'm, I'm warning. What are you gonna do? I'm warning. In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. What can you I'm do in real life? What do you think about that? <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> Hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? Um. Um? <laughs> really? Come here. At least you actually got to play some kind of like, gameplay. Admittedly, it was on Crash Bandicoot, but. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. I'm coming. Asshole. Yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm, uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner, definitely less gray in the temples. Well, they obviously knew he wasn't dead, didn't we? Sam? <laughs> it's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam! Oh, all right, all right, all right, take it easy, take it easy. <laughs> <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did, right? There. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I... I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. <laughs> Nathan, we killed a guard. Okay, so they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. He's a sandwich. Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. would come back. I know, Nathan. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. <laughs> hey, hey. You still with me? I need some air. Yeah, he got shot. And like you wouldn't go back to him like after all these years. At least to get the body back, you know. Just leave your brother there. He's dead, whatever. How did you get out? When did you get out? 
How'd you even get here? Find me. All right, right, right. Slow down. Have a seat. I want to hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. What's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. Tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. <laughs> These were crazy stories. Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah, that, uh, that actually happened. Come on, man, what did I miss? Jesus, damn, where do I start? You missed like three games? That's the best part. <laughs> three whole games worth of stuff you missed. I found El Dorado, I explored Shambhala, I discovered him. Yeah, let's go for the first one. Okay. Uh, Here we got. A few years back, I got roped into uh, breaking into this Turkish museum to steal this oil lamp. Okay. Oil lamp? Uh, it was an artifact from Marco Polo's lost treasure fleet. Kublai Khan's treasure. Yeah. Yeah, and as it turns out, it was a whole hell of a lot more ships and just treasure hmm um, should you like or dislike and, uh, <laughs> we made it out alive. Barely. I like could be great Tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological gold mine and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Hmm. Paid off the car, the house, engagement ring. The engagement ring. I'm Thanks, married. dude. Rock on. Uh, Elena, from the <laughs> stories, that's my wife. You gotta come meet her. Tonight, dinner. At my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you. Nathan, I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Is the name Hector Alcazar ring about with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? Funny story, but um, last year he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. So we're going to be playing as him, do you think? Well, you're not reading tonight. It looks like it at the moment. <laughs> but you know, just starting out, what do you expect? What will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> it's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can. But I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time. Which I am sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote? <laughs> I am a man of fortune and I must seek. I like how he thinks. What the hell was that? Yeah, what the was that? Of a lifetime. Senor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Sacame de aquí. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? Samuel. 
Are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Yeah, me too. I'm going in a minute. 35 minutes. In fact, I think that's a good place to stop. Holy yep, shit. chapter 5. There we go. So, I'll be back again tomorrow. Hopefully, Sandon, you'll join me tomorrow as well. But until then, this is Jim B. Please, same, please like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you all next time.